Hello, I am Sivaramaya. Let us continue our FAQs, frequently asked questions or interview questions. The next question is register storage specifier. Register storage specifier. What is it? and where it is used. When we say INT suppose X. So X is allocated space in memory. If we say register INT Y then Y is stored in the CPU register. CPU has registers on it. That is a computer CPU. It has registers in it. So this um, variable Y is allocated space in the register of the CPU. So what is the difference? If the variable is present in register CPU instead of memory, then the CPU will be able to access that memory, that register variable fast instead of getting it from memory. So in place of in, in places where the code is to be very fast, in such a case the variables are stored in register. Registers. In that case we use register storage variable. Here we can see with an example. So the reason here is speed. This is used used when very fast execution is required. Let us see how it is used. INT X 10 register INT Y is equal to 20. Display. percentage d percentage d x comma y run so you can see both are displayed so here we don't see any difference but the speed I mean to display this x y values you have to get data from x and y x value is stored in memory whereas y value is stored in register so y values got very fast but that is uh, significant only when you do uh, large operations. Suppose uh, uh, you are repeatedly uh, getting the value and displaying, suppose hundreds or even thousands of times, then only it is significant. Once or twice or even ten times is not much significant. When you are doing this large number of times, then significant time will be saved in such cases. That is very rare cases, critical cases, where time is very critical. In such cases only, this is used. Otherwise, it's not much important. Next question. Compare Compare the following. x is equal to x plus 1 x plus plus compare the following so what is it what is the difference and is there any advantage disadvantage so x is equal to x plus 1 x value is incremented by 1 x plus plus x value incremented by 1 so what is the difference any advantage the only difference is x is equal to x plus 1 it takes more code compared to x plus plus so x plus plus is faster it is faster and it takes less code so x plus plus is faster and takes less code so again 
this is significant only when you are doing critical operations where time is very important otherwise it's not much different